In this video, I'm going to show you how to add full motion video to your project. So sometimes when you're in a project and you've got all your slides set up, you might want to have a piece of full motion video playing in your project or maybe at the end. For instance, I have a set of closing trailers that I like to put at the end of my videos. So what I'm going to do to be able to add this is we're going to come to the end here and you can see this is our last actual slide and then I'm going to add one more and this time I'm going to add from collection and I'm just going to head over to business show two. I'm going to click on the first slide here and I'm going to add single. Now, as you can see, it adds this to the end of my program. Now, obviously that's not full motion video. So what we want to do is we want to go over to the text area and we're just going to clear out those text areas. And then we're going to go to outline. And we're going to remove all three of the outline areas until we have a blank screen. So now we can go over to video. We can hit browse and we can choose a video to add in here. Now I've got a bumper here that tells you to insert your email. Okay. You can see it's full motion video and it's at the end of our program here. So there you go. Now the cool thing is this one's already set and ready to go. So all we have to do now is create our video. However, there are some options. For instance, if we needed to have this stay on longer, we can come down here and we can add a few more seconds to this. Now you'll see it'll keep that last screen up there for a while. And then of course it will rotate. So now we've got our full motion video at the end of our video. Now, one other thing to note is if your video has audio, you can actually hit this add audio from Enter video button and email for the free e-course. And you can see that the audio plays along with the video as well. So that's how to add full motion video to your projects.